Marriage is not to be entered into lightly, but respectfully, deliberately, and in the knowledge that your spouse will stand next to you in whatever lies ahead. Into this union, Angelo and Christine will now come to be joined. So when Angelo said he met this woman and really, really liked her, I had to check her out. Christine was flawless, smart, funny, and somehow possessing the uncanny ability to speed up Angelo time. <laughs> Marriage, based upon love, endures through the ages of trends, fads, and times. Marriage, based upon love, will thrive and continue to grow as long as the foundation of that marriage is based upon God, who is love, and Angelo and Christine's love for each other. When the one whose hand you're holding is the one who holds your heart, when the one whose eyes you gaze into gives you hope and dreams their start, when the one you think of first and last is the one who holds you tight, and the things you plan together make the whole world seem just right. <laughs> Angelo, do you reach out in love to receive Christine and choose to share your life with her? Will you promise always to give her your expression of your ever-growing love? Will you comfort her, be sensitive to her needs, express her feelings with her, listen to her, put your trust in her, and forsaking all others, be her intimate friend and honor her as your equal? I do. All right. Yes. Halfway there. Christine, do you reach out in love to receive Angelo and choose to share your life with him? Will you promise always to give him your expression of your ever-growing love? Will you comfort him? Be sensitive to his needs. Express your feelings with him. Listen to him. Put your trust in him. And forsaking all others, be his intimate friend and honor him as your equal? Absolutely. I mean, I do. <laughs> we'll take it. I promise you my everlasting devotion. My loyalty, my respect, and my unconditional love. I promise I will always be here to listen to you, to hold your hand, and to listen. And to laugh when you're really happy. I promise to be your protector, your advisor, and your counselor. Your friend, your family, and your everything. <laughs> These two bottles of wine represent your individual spirits. All that you are, all that you have been, and all that you will become. This common cup in the center is your marriage. It is the place where you are forever blending your lives together. It represents the joining of two spirits, two lives, two souls. Drink now in celebration of your pledge and the blending of your lives. May you remember this day of commitment you have sealed with the drinking of the new wine, joining your lives as one. Angelo, Christine, remember this day as you go into the world together. Improve it where you can. Bring happiness to those who need it. With the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Please kiss the bride. We did it. It is my pleasure to introduce Mr. and Mrs. Angelo Delicio. Christine and Angelo, the new Mr. and Mrs. Delicio. One of the things Christine told me she loves about Angelo was that he shared her loves of whiskey, craft beers, sleeping late, and softball. Boy, am I glad. Before Angelo, I was the one she recruited for all of those things. <laughs> and if you know me, I hate whiskey and beer. Give me my captain, it's over there. I'm up in the Kraken on, and I am no athlete. I'm sure her softball buddies are relieved to have Angelo as a sub instead of me. <laughs> Thank you guys! Thank you! You're welcome. I think we need to work something out where I get to keep her on maybe like Tuesdays and Sundays, and maybe Jenna can have her on Wednesdays, and you can have her the rest of the days of the week, because she truly is has become my best friend and I can't imagine life without her and <laughs> even if she is a thousand miles away I need to keep her 
And until we iron out the details, let us raise our glasses and, and toast to the happy couple. He took every single chemistry class. He went to Ferris State University. He graduated. He moved to Huntington Beach, California. He experienced, he surfed. He can't even walk across a parking lot without tripping over something. He's on a surfboard. He experienced everything he wanted to experience and, and he moved back where his home base was, where his family and his friends, where, where, his, where, where everything is, where, where, where he started off. He met an unbelievable girl. Yeah. And we are all here to celebrate this night. And I am so honored to be up here because I did not think that this night was actually going to happen. I had some doubt. I'm not going to say, you know, this is Angelo. As a married man, I believe I'm supposed to impart you with some wisdom here. <laughs> Number one, just three things, three simple things. Never go to bed in an argument. Always stay up and argue. <laughs> Number two, in times of trouble, remember these words from Oscar Wilde. Women are meant to be loved, not understood. <laughs> and number three, simple but true, you'll never be right again. Congratulations, guys.